Hey guys, what is up? Today in this video I'm going to be showing you how to take notes on your TI-84 plus CE calculator. So, you can find your calculator's name at the top of the calculator right here. However, if you have the TI-84 plus C Silver Edition calculator, then you will need to refer to a different video that you can find right here, or in the link in the description. Okay, so to get started we need to install a program on your calculator. So let's go and do that. So to install the program on our calculator, we first need to take our calculator charging cable, plug one side into the calculator, and the other side into our computer. There will be a link in the description for this file right here, called CE Text Editor. Download that, and then open it up. You will see these three files here, so just highlight them, and then drag them onto your desktop. And then close this. Now we need to use a program called TI Connect CE to transfer this to our calculator. If you don't already have this installed, there will be a link for it in the description below. So let's go ahead and open that program. And we'll bring up this screen. So we're going to click on the Calculator Explorer tab. And then we'll show you, show you the list of all the things on your calculator. Don't worry if it doesn't look exactly like this, it will look different for every calculator. If you don't see anything show up at all, make sure your calculator is turned on. Okay, so we're going to highlight these two files, text editor CE and text editor files, and drag it into um, this list. Then we're just going to click on all connected calculators and click send. If it asks you to replace any files for some reason, just click yes. Okay, so now we have the text editing program on our calculator. We can edit the text on our calculator, however this is a bit tedious, so I'm going to show you how to edit the text on your computer and send it to the calculator. So to do this we need to right click on our desktop, click new, and then text document. We can call it whatever we want, I'm just going to call it notes. Now open it up and type whatever you want to send to the calculator. Okay, now we're going to go to File, Save, or Control S, and then just close this window. This is where we use this convert text. So we're going to click click on this note file, and we're going to drag it onto the convert text. You'll see a window flash, and then a notes file should appear in your desktop. If it doesn't appear for some reason, right click on the desktop and click refresh. Now we're going to open back up TI Connect CE. Go to Calculator Explorer once again, and then drag in this file we just created into the calculator. And then again, make sure you're on all connected calculators, and check this little box right here and hit send. Okay, now we can close this, and we are done sending the files to our calculator. Now that we are done, we can unplug our calculator from the computer and turn it on. Now we're going to click on the program button, and you will see two programs here. You might have more if you have previously written or copied other programs, but these are the um, programs that we are worried about. So T-Files, you just need to ignore. It's something that lets the program run. What we need to click on is Notes, and then we're, to open it we're going to click on Program, then we're going to click on enter when you have it highlighted and then we're going to press enter again now the screen will pop up since we have copied our note file to the calculator you'll see notes.txt if you have not copied anything to the calculator you can click y equals to create a new document you can rename it with window or delete it with zoom and then to exit just click graph so to open it we're just going to click on enter and then everything that we wrote on the calculator on the computer is now here. We can edit it. Um, delete is basically backspace. And then uh, we can type things in with the little green letters that are on the calculator here. So for example, if I pressed program, it would type in C. If I want to type in numbers, pre click on alpha and you'll see the little A in the corner disappears. So this is basically a toggle button. So if the A is not there, then we can type in numbers. Okay, and then if we want to save it, just click on Y equals, 
and then exit. Okay, that's how you write notes on the TI-84 plus CE calculator. If you have any questions, leave them in the comments below, and I will try and answer them within 48 hours. I hope this helped, and if it did, don't forget to hit that like button, and subscribe for more videos like this. I will see you in the next video.